Greetings, this is this and I me. Mean. My goal for today, one, pay off my loan debts, and two, just simply get a little more, um, get a little more stuff done than I did last time. And the first thing that I'm going to do, um, with a little bit of input and help from you guys, like, you know, you, you helped me to, to think to do this, is I'm going to get rid of this pathway here. Yes. And my controller is just drifting to the left. Just drifting northwest. I wish I could get it to stop. Stop. Whatever. Um, we're going to delete that path. So they're not going to walk this way anymore. And I'm going to have to let them clear off of here. Maybe I can periodically delete, like, the furthest anyone's gone so far is, is this path. Whoops, I need to still be on the bulldozer tool, please. Um, so let's delete that one. Okay. And then if people go further this way, I'll delete another one. Um, because it's actually hurting my- it's hurting their happiness a little bit, apparently, to- have so much path to travel with nothing happening there. I do kind of still want them to go to be able to go here because there's the photo spot. Maybe that'll be at least something, but I'd like to get rid of, yeah, like this was all dead space right here, this section, and then this is all dead space too besides a bench. So if we could get this dude to get on out of here <laughs> um, and close off that part temporarily as well, that would be great. Um, so that's sort of step one. Um, well, it's one of the steps, one. Okay, the- oh, you've got to be kidding me. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, we have to time this perfectly. Um, I'm not on the boulders at all anymore! Ah! Yeah! Uh-oh, he's stranded. What do they do if they are on a path that has no paths? Did they just die? What do they do? Where are you going, buddy? I I wasn't prepared for this. Uh-oh. He's not happy. Okay, we're gonna give him a path. We're gonna give him a path. Don't worry. Don't worry. Take that path. Um, It's much easier to, le to delete when I have this tool open anyway. So we'll just wait. Please don't sit on the bench. Just walk that way. No, no, don't sit down. Dang it. How long are you gonna sit on the bench? A month? Two months? How many months? <laughs> ah, okay. Well, there's other things I have to do. So I guess I just have to leave them be for now. If they're really not going to go anywhere else, we're just going to leave them be. I should just delete the bench once he gets off of it so that no one else will walk down there. No, no, no. This is perfect. We have time. We have time. We have time. Ready? 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 Three, two, one. I'm gonna have to just do this one. Okay. That's as far as we can get it. Um, wait, wait. Oh, bobsled coaster! <gasps> nice! Okay, let's not research anything for a hot second. Okay. Uh, research is on hold. Research is on hold. Okay. Put that back. Put that back. Okay. There. I've shortened the path. I mean, I'll shorten it to here, even. I'll shorten it to here. You think you can stop me? Haha, <laughs> there we go. Okay. Um, that should help at least a little. I know it's not the best. But then, the other thing, I was like, this is very exposed. <laughs> all of the people, all of the people on that ride are literally looking straight at straight at the employee path here so let's grab our fencing and block that off okay there we go i know you still see it here i don't really we need like a gate or something do they have things like that do they have doors like things that will open and close I know, it sounds normal. It doesn't sound that crazy. I'm more security staff. Okay, I know. I know. I don't have the budget for it. 
they're gonna have to just deal with it for now. Um, uh, structures, blah, 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 gates. Oh, perfect. This matches. This is great. It's a, that one's short, though. Can we go with this one, maybe? Is this too wide? Um, how do I place it, like, it doesn't seem like it's locking on. Is this the right direction? Why doesn't it snap to a path? This is just a decor item. It's kind of annoying, but, uh, okay. I can't get it just where I need it. Will the employees walk through there? Ew. It's terrible. It is better than just nothing there, though, right? Like, it is blocking more than nothing. Maybe it'll help. I don't know if the employees can actually go through there. They can! Oh, they just walked right on through. <laughs> okay, fine. So, there was vandals, there was rain, it's November, no one's gonna like this ride in November, take the price down. Um, oh, we need more haulers, we need more staff, we need more everything. But we're working on building up a little bit of money right now. Um, to pay back our loan, okay? Because every moment that we don't pay back the loan, bad things happen. Bad, bad things. Um, okay. So, what else was I, what was I, where, how, who? Let's look at my finances. So, November, we profited $9. It's not a lot, but... It's something. We, we've we stopped research as well, so shouldn't that help? It's just because everything's dropping. Like, no one comes to the park this time of year. No one comes to the park. Okay. Um. Let me see how they feel. How do the guests feel? Um. The immersion is so down. Path is really disgusting. No high-intensity rides. We've got to get a nice high-intensity ride for our park goers. The end of the year, it's a slump right now, you know? We give them a high-intensity ride, then that'll really just liven everything back up. Right? I don't have a nice place for one. I don't have a nice place for anything, because this place is a mess. And I know I could just stop and move on to the next place right now, but I feel like I haven't learned all that I can learn from this park yet. I don't want to start a new one just yet. Like, if I keep starting new ones and, like, moving on to the next one too quickly every time, then I'm never, like, you know, playing the long game and, like, learning about that aspect. So, you know, we do want... Like, for the other parks, the reason I probably didn't have very many money problems is because I was ending them because the goal would end before I ever really ended up using all of my money, my initial startup money. But this time we actually went through our startup money and we have to actually like earn now. So I want to work on this park for a little more before we move on to whatever the next one is going to be. Um, coasters, Bob sled coaster, 1,500 and up. Oh wait, we have a wooden coaster? Well, that one is probably pretty exciting. Um, the junior coaster, is yeah we that one wasn't worth making because they want high intensity um how do i okay I, I i would like to build one myself to a degree but let me see how are the intensities looking for these peoples low 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 um i can't like oh build without scenery oh my god ten thousand dollars seven thousand dollars oh my god Okay, low, low. Intensity for all of these is still low. Uh, low, 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 low. Why? Why is it so... Why can't anyone make an interesting coaster? Um, wait, why wasn't the log flume showing up anymore? Can you only have one? Of each type of coaster, and I've already made one? I don't know. Joust, the intensity is low. Intensity is medium. 
Um, medium, medium. Okay. So it seems like you can find a bit more of a medium intensity with these wooden coasters. Uh, like they have height limits. You know, at the last place I was trying to build my coaster um, as tall as I could. And I couldn't build it that tall. So it still wasn't very intense. Okay, some of these are medium intensity. So we can possibly get a medium intensity ride. Okay. But I definitely don't have the budget for that right now. I am poor. Okay, let's just play then. Um... So the staffing is causing some problems. We have one person in this, this, you know, zone that really is struggling. And then we have one person that's wandering around. Um, I don't know, they're just gonna have to, to just get better. <laughs> And they have two haulers. Okay, I say we build another shop. That'll be a cheap enough thing. It'll bring in some more money, right? Um, I never built my donut shop. We got candy and we got donuts. It's only 230. And I'm going to put it here. Because last time I wanted to put it here and then I was like, wait, I can't put one there. That would never work. But no, it will work. I just have to put a fence. Um, just have to put a fence around this spot to hide everything. I can do that. Oh, but the lights are going to be ruined. Okay, that's fine. Start with the fence. Build that first. Um, I just take this tool and I grab the fence. Da ding. And now it's a little weird because they have fence right along the path here, whereas in the other spots there's like some breathing room. But that'll have to be good enough. It's very cramped back here, but just ignore it. Definitely just pretend that it's all perfectly fine. Okay, we get rid of that. And I have to get rid of the piece of lights. Okay. Perfect. Beautiful. Give me... Did I accidentally build something over there? Okay, no. Give me the path. Employee path. Okay. Right on over this way. I'm not using too much money in my... Ooh. We're gonna go broke again. No. Everything's fine. Look at these rides that we have for the rain time. Whoa, rain and lightning. Everybody wants to get on this ride. And the rain and lightning? Definitely. Um, everybody loves this ride during the rain. What else? They can still go on this one, technically. This is... Nobody likes this ride. Unfortunately. Um, look at the umbrella. Oh, the rain is over. But we made some good money there, right? Surely we made some good money. Uh, wh wait, why are you saying no? Oh, right, no customer path. Maybe that's for the best right now because they're stocking it up. But let me get the customer path. Don't you worry, guys. Bam, there you go. But also... Um, let me check the prices here. Let me check the prices. Only a dollar for a donut. That is way too cheap. Two dollars for a donut. Okay. It's like, how much is it for a burger? It's like three or something. Yeah. Okay. Two dollars for a donut. That's still a great price. You guys are still, you still gotta be like, wow, the prices. Oh my god. <laughs> um, so that's one more thing for them to do. Um, their path is slightly shorter. Um, so they, they should feel like, you know, there's more to do because there's less empty space. Um, these are all good things. I can't believe we're in year three. Year three, park rating. If you just look at the rating, it looks pretty good. Experiences are at 74%. Not too bad. Not too bad. This person said experiences were, hmm. Oh, oh, but, oh, eh. I mean, but for the most part, everyone seems to like it. No one high intensity. Okay. We just have to earn enough money that we have some high intensity rides. Yeah. They're saying that there's filth, but honestly, there's not. Wait, this is a, it's not a permanent thing. I have to go back to it. Oh. 
Okay. Oh, actually, I can't even... Like, this part technically hasn't been completed yet, because I haven't gotten the have no loan debts part. <laughs> That's not done yet. Okay, fine. Wow. Big loss in December. Huge. That's scary. January? Um... Also not the best. Why? There are trash bins. There's not that many janitors, but I mean, it's complicated, okay? It's complicated. I guess let's add more trash bins. <sighs> They're expensive, though, guys. They're expensive. What do you want from me? Okay, let me put another one over there. And where else is trash sort of piling up? Unfortunately and unnecessarily. Let's put one here. There's one so close to there already. Let's put one here. There's one so close to there already. They don't need that many. Oh, but the vandals! They knocked over this trash bin! Okay, they fixed it. Um... I've added one more trash bin. And it's really the vandals that's the problem. But my security... We've got someone for zone 1 and we've got someone for zone 2. Oh. Okay. Zone 2 needs to be expanded. Ugh, unfortunately. I know, it's already so much space for them to take care of and then they have to take care of more. I'm sorry. Okay, but there. That's better. Much better. And no one's taking care of zone 3. So if any vandal vandals go over there, there's nothing we can do about it right now. Mm, I can't hire another entertainer. Chester is our only dude. Chester, he's killing it out there. Um, and he, we have to just rely on him and only him because I don't have the budget. Okay. So if people will just stop being upset with me, we're fine. Hey, look! The immersion is slightly better! Yes! The emergent is slightly better. Okay, look, 31 people saw Chester as a shark, and they all, they're loving it. 23 people want to go on top scan. Are you saying I should make the queue even longer for top scan? I don't, do I really need to? It says customers. Oh, top scan. Oh, God, okay, okay. Everybody pause. <sighs> It says customers 984. Theoretical amount of customers per month 94. Customers last month 30. Missed customers last month 2. Favorite of 75. So what it kind of sounds like is I at least missed two people last month that wanted to go on it but that didn't get the chance. So the queue, if the queue is longer, that helps, right? But I'm afraid of making the queue too long. Like with this, it's they think this is too long. They literally think this is too long for the slide. This one and this one are also so long and there's never anyone on them. But I don't think that they mind for these ones. What is it? This thing? Okay. Um. Let's see. Scroll down. Scroll down. Okay. Um... Theoretical amount of customers per month, 83. Customers last month, 4. Missed customers, 0. Yeah, it's very unpopular in the colder months. Whew. Okay. But I don't think they mind that the queue is that long. Wait, I didn't check the opinions. There really aren't even any because no one is literally on it. Rebecca! I didn't mean to click on an active person. Why does she have... Why is this... Whoa. That's crazy! That's so cool! So she came into the park, she sat at a bench. Um, and then she went to the swinging ship. And then, then she exited the swinging ship? Okay. And then she made her way all the way over to top scan? Wow, so she went from swinging ship straight to top scan. Then when she left Top Scan, 
She sat at a bench, I think, and then she looped all the way around again to that bench. She's kind of aimless. <laughs> Are they all like this? Then she got a soft drink, and then she sat at that bench. And then she came over this way, and she went on the Gravitron. And then she got off of it. And maybe went back on It's kind of hard to tell. Then she got a hot dog. And then she went back on it, and then she got off of it again. But then I don't know where she went, because it gets kind of... Maybe that's where she's at right now. Oh yeah, they give you a little list. I was just trying to follow the pink line, because that seemed fun, but... That's so crazy. No, but I wanted to click on top scan. Um, satisfaction is 75. How do we make the satisfaction better? I don't know. Okay, but we're gonna leave Rebecca. Um, she's grumpy. Oh. Okay, maybe we should put another bathroom. Because they don't want to walk all the way down here to this bathroom. Let's put a bathroom... Do I have the money for it? I only have $900. Um, not park utilities. Shops. $250. let us put a bathroom right here. I didn't... It just hopped over at the last second. I don't know why it moved, but okay, I guess it wanted to be there. Let's let it go there. Um... Just so that there's another thing along this path for people. And if they don't want to go back to that bathroom over there, they can go to this one over here. Um, it probably would be making the most sense to put it in this zone, but that's fine. Um, okay. So we did that, but I also want them to have more... More Q for top scan. No, it's fine for now, right? Is it? I don't know. They dropped off a busload of people that like this ride. So, I feel like it makes sense to make it, um, to make the queue longer right now. But maybe it doesn't matter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Zoom in faster. Look at this. Look at this little ride. Uh, the little carousel. And then top scan. Going wild. Going wild. This one you can't see. Okay, well, it is March, so popularity in general should be going back up. I just really breezed through the the cold months, the fall and the winter. That's kind of crazy. Okay, so yeah, everything should be going up soon enough. Um, I'm going to have to pay off more of my loan in a moment when we get some profit again. It's big. It's 300 loss there because I built the the toilets but um otherwise we can we can hang in there for long enough right we can turn a profit i've made some good improvements i've i've made some calculated improvements you know that were like low cost but hopefully significant impact at least semi significant Another shop that I might like to expand to a new place would be another umbrella shop further down somewhere. But I'm going to have to find some way to get the... Um oh, the vandals have left the park! Oh, what great news. I'm going to have to find some way to get the employees to go further along. Oh, another thing you guys told me about. Um, Another thing you guys told me about was... It probably is too costly for me to do right now, and I don't even know if I have it unlocked. But it was um, adding some some rain coverage over the queues so that the uh, park goers don't feel... Would it be roofs <laughs> or pavilions? I mean, we do have the little umbrellas, that's true. But if we add something to cover over the queues, then when they're standing in line and it's raining, it's not so bad. So that would be that would be a good thing for me to add. But as of right now, I don't know if we can afford that. I'll put like one or two umbrellas down though. You know what? Like why not? Um, which type do we want? Kind of feeling these square ones a little bit. Um, and we've got to change the color. Um, I want, like, a blue. 
Oh, they're actually triangle print. <laughs> I had no idea. I was wondering why I was displaying two colors. Okay. Well, blue and... I might just have to do blue and white. Because I don't know if I like blue and pink or blue and orange. For this particular thing. We could do maybe blue and yellow, but I don't really have much yellow going on anywhere, do I? Maybe like a goldish sort of yellow? Okay, um, I'm gonna put a little... I mean, that spot is a little intrusive, isn't it? Because this is supposed to have decor and look nice. So how about an umbrella at this spot? Da ding Is it centered? It's centered enough, right? I feel like the umbrellas that I put in before were ones that snapped to the path. But, um, okay. An umbrella there, an umbrella down here. It technically helps with decor. And maybe also they would like to be there when it's raining. We can't know for certain, but perhaps they'd like it. And then one more over this way. Um, not every single place in existence can be protected from the rain, okay? But some of them, we'll put a few. <laughs> Yeah, is there a pathway attachment that is, um, an umbrella? I don't see one from here. Okay. Well then, good. Okay. I have $500. I mean, yeah, 500 Okay, 600 Um, but... Things aren't so bad. Like, if I spent 250 to build the toilets in March, and our profit was negative 280 it's not so bad. Where is the one for, like, me constructing something? I don't see... Would that be... Building maintenance? It was 250 though. It was more expensive than that. Or did I just buy it now in April? I haven't got a clue. Who cares? Um, what we care about is going fast. No, what we care about is checking this. Has this... Is this back to going up? No, no, I don't want that one. Ew. Why does everyone hate this ride all of a sudden? <laughs> um... Oh, God. Like, when do I start turning this up again? When do I start turning the price up? 12 guests, 2 in queue. Oh, ooh, 12, 23 guests, super for low intensity. Jack up the prices. Is this low intensity? I don't think it is. Um, how do you tell? Intensity medium. So it's these two over here. The carousel and the, the slide. Well, um, I guess I can't do anything then. <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of room on the queue for the carousel, so hopefully they'll just go and it'll be fine. Okay, let's check everything again. Um, with our guests. Why do I feel like their happiness is going down? Uh, still just so many people that want to go on top scan. I, I mean, guys, it's here, okay? What do you want from me? Everybody just likes top scan. I should make two top scans. <laughs> Um, I mean, if you want to go, you want to go, right? Ugh, God. What is, what is a girl to do? Okay, look at that beautiful, beautiful profit. Look at that. $112 profit. We can work with that. We can most definitely work with that. And by work with that, I mean I'm just going to have to pay off some of my loan. Um... Is this the loan? Okay. I have $3,800 that I still owe. If I pay $100 of it, that's kind of like, you know, how much I could afford based off of my last profit margin. But with every month as it goes into the summer, we should be doing better, right? So I'm actually going to pay off 200 Because if I pay off 200 it's also going to drop my monthly fee. And, um, we had some money in the bank as well. It's not like we were at zero over here, you know? So, yeah. Pay off 
pay off 200. Why not? Maybe I should pay off 300. Yeah, do it, you know? Like I said, why not? Okay, because we're profiting this month, okay? We're profiting. I just have to... Um... I just have to get more people in, into the shop. That's all. Should we put another vending machine down? Would that make us more money? I already have two. One there and one here. How much money do these make us? Um, not all that much. What about this one? Hello? How much money is this? Oh, even less. Oh, actually, it's good and it's bad. <laughs> hmm. Okay, I don't feel confident in, in making another one of those just yet. How much did these- like, this is a brand new donut shop. How much has this been making us? Zero dollars. Negative two dollars. What in the heck is wrong with this shop? Uh... Hello? Why? They're so- Oh no, I think I have more shops than I have people. So, like, the amount of maintenance that it takes to maintain the shop is not even paying for what the shop gets because we can't, we don't have that many customers in our total place. Is that what you're telling me? Because that's pretty bad. That's pretty bad. Hopefully that's not what's actually happening, right? Okay, do we spend a little bit of decor here or there? I have to build more stuff. It's so boring. <laughs> okay, it's June. May, it looks really ugly, right? Negative 241. But considering we spent $400, no, $300 to pay off our loan, that's not bad. That means we would have profited. Okay, and now that it's June, we up the prices on this one again. Everybody wants to go on this one. Look at that. There's actually, actually people wanted to go on that one now. Okay. Good. Is this too expensive? Okay. Is this too expensive? Okay. Is this too expensive? Nah. I think they're all fine, probably. Um. Okay. I think, yeah, to a degree, our park is maybe a little too big for the amount of people we've got here. Surprisingly. But I want to add some little bits of decor here and there. That's what's going to help us right now. And I would love to research some things. You know. To have some more interesting things. TVs are too expensive. I would love to research and have more interesting things here or there. Because I don't like what I have. But we're just going to work with what we have. Because that's the cheapest way. Okay, so we're just going to work with what we have. Um, I'm just going to find some some interesting things here and there. Um, like perhaps a stone archway. But those are so expensive as well. These are the least expensive, but this is... What is... This doesn't look like an archway to me. Oh, you're supposed to build two sides of it? Kind of. Oh, it's cute, actually. It's cute, and like if we made it pink. But I can't. Well, we could put one. Like here. Um. Why would I put an archway here? <laughs> it's made to go over a spot, a space that's three wide, it looks like. Ugh. So it can't even fit anyway. Okay. I've got to just... I think I'm literally just going to end up putting more... Um, more flowers down. Oh, look. An actual door. But it says closed. So I don't think it's functional. A heart! <laughs> Where am I supposed to put this? Oh. Hey, guys. I don't mind the heart. But we make it pink. That's kind of cute. Like, it's just like a... It makes it a little bit warmer. A little more friendly. 
Um, yeah, I like the heart. I know it's expensive, but we're having it anyway. Can I put it right here? Will you let me? Oh, I accidentally lowered it into the ground somehow. I think that's pretty much like on the wall, right? And centered. It's centered enough, that's for sure. Okay, okay, that's cute. That's cute. We'll put one on this side as well. Da ding Is it still going two times speed? Oh god, it is. Okay. Oh, it's already July. Okay, slow it down. Put one there, we'll put one there, we'll put one here. Yeah. Okay, and then we'll put one here. And then that's all for now for the hearts. We're not gonna overdo it, okay? We're not gonna overdo it, but it is so cute. Yeah. Okay, do they count? Like, do they like that as decor? I hope so. Um, so this category literally has so many things in it. Oh wait, did I accidentally click on everything or something? Is it showing me everything? It's showing me all structures right now. No wonder I was so overwhelmed. <laughs> Shapes. Is that where the heart was? No, that's not what they meant. Where's the heart? Um, I don't know what they're considering it. A building? Oh, a detail. Maybe they're considering it a detail? Ah, okay. Yeah, there's hearts, there's stars. Oh, the, here, there these glass awnings. I think if I put those over my queue lines, that would help. Um, how much are they, though? This is going to be a lot. Um, extreme intensity? I don't have that. We're waiting to build up money. <laughs> We're wait waiting to build up money until we can get the extreme intensity. You're just going to have to wait. A plane, a bike, a truck, a car. Like, well, let's get, like, a car or a scooter or something. This little pink car. Uh, let's put this down somewhere. Wait, how much is it? $33? Okay. Um. I feel like I want to put this somewhere where it makes sense. Because that's, like, fun, you know? Because it would actually make sense. But now nah, let's just stick it anywhere. Let's stick it over here. Does this place already have too much decor? These guys spend a lot of time in queue, though. So, <laughs> there. I need more beautiful stuff here. I need, like, trees. Oh, wait, I forgot about our map board. Yeah, let's get a map board. Oh, I already have one. Oh, but they want one over here, too. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Brilliant. I'm a genius for this. I'm a genius for this. I don't know why I did it off-center like that, but it actually kind of works great. I actually like it like that. Okay. Um, don't go crazy with the spending, though. It's August. Okay. Everything's going up, right? Um... Hey, stop. <laughs> I was looking at that. Um, park admissions are up to $165! Yes! But then it's gonna drop. This is like the only month I'm gonna be making profit. No... I still can't afford a coaster. I'm not getting out a second loan. I will only get out another loan if I've successfully paid off my first one. And I haven't paid off my first one yet, so... We have to wait. It's gonna be like year five or something. <laughs> oh wait, maybe I should do another advertising campaign. That helped. But should I do an advertising campaign in a month that's already doing good? Yes, because we have enough money for it. Um, let's do the log ride, maybe. Um, so one month, flyer, advertising for, um, this one. Did I click on it? Advertising for this one. Did I click it? Oh, I did. One month, flyer, Maple Mountain, $72. That is a lot, but it helped when we advertised for the Gravitron. Okay. Let's do that, and if that does well, then it will help pay off my loan. Top scan is full right now. These other ones, no one cares about them. <sighs> okay. It's fine. Um, where are the trees? We're just gonna add, like, one or two trees. I don't have any pretty ones this time, though. Or maybe I just didn't scroll down? Maybe I just didn't scroll down? Maple, palm, pine... Yeah, I like... I like these ones, please. Of course, we all know I like these ones, but I want it to be slightly less of a purple tint. Um, 
slightly dull, less dull, like just make it a little bit more obnoxiously bright. <laughs> okay. Um, over here, near the candy, to let people know, hey, that's where the candy's at. And then another one over here. I like to put them near the benches to offer shade. Okay. With every tree that gets added, everyone is a little bit happier. So we're going to do that, and then we're going to take and add a palm tree. Where, where are the... Scroll up. Ooh, there's so many different ones. Let's get one of the ones that's only worth $23. <laughs> I mean, only costs $23. Okay. Rotate, rotate. I can't put this on this because it's a slope or what? Looks like they were letting me put it there before. They let me put it all the way down here. Fine. Then I'll put it all the way down there. Uh, palm tree there. And palm tree. Ugh, uh, this type of palm tree there. Perfect. Okay, now stop spending money. I only have $119. But look at the profit. We made that profit. Oh. Okay, the operating profit was positive. But not the overall profit. Um, that's fine. Let me look at my finances. How often in the past couple of months has the operating profit been positive? It was positive in August and June and May, and April. Okay, so not so bad. But the overall, because I had to spend some money on some other things. Overall, um, dipped down. Okay. But I have to pause my spending for a moment in order to get more... Is this working? Is it even working? In order to get more money. It's already September... Okay, we're, we're squeezing out the last bit of life from this ride. Come on. Squeezing it out with this advertisement. It feels like there are a lot of people here. Uh-oh. Not the rain again. Okay. Let's dip this one down a little bit. Um, and then these ones, I, the prices are still where they were before, right? Kind of. Maybe that one's a little bit more... Um, look, everyone's buying umbrellas. And by everyone, I mean, no, yeah, look, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. There are a good number of people with umbrellas. And look how cute the hearts are. Okay. We check the satisfaction. I really thought the immersion would have been up a little bit more by now because of the hearts and the trees. I really thought. Okay. So we're going to need to get a why does everyone like the soft drinks place so much <laughs> we're going to need to get a high intensity ride I mean to get another loan so that we can get a high intensity ride like that just has to happen right it has to happen um so I just have to pay off my other loan and then get a new loan I mean I could get a loan to pay off the loan but Nobody wants to do that. Nobody wants to do that. Wait, wait, wait. What did that just say? Recent. Okay, Maple Mountain advertisement ended. Effective 99%. See, that's pretty cool. That was worth our money, right? Hopefully... It was worth our money. Statistics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um... Customers last month, 50. Okay, sure. Uh, max profit. Revenue last month, $200. Profit last month, $100. And it cost us like $75 to do the advertising. So it actually... <sighs> maybe wasn't... <laughs> hey, any money, is, any money is helpful, I guess. Technically speaking, any money is helpful. When does this really die off? November? Uh-oh. <laughs> Okay, not looking good. 
Um. Well. Okay. But yeah, the immersion. Is this because everyone walks right past this path? I mean, that's how it was at the other park, right? Like, is this really killing things because it's it's in such a high traffic area that they can see all these buildings right here. Like, maybe it shouldn't meet up with a regular path right there. Maybe it should meet up with a regular path like over here. Where they would just see this little bit of path and the back of that. Yeah. I guess I can try that. Okay. That's the new point for employees. <laughs> maybe that makes it a little bit better. I don't actually have any clue. We can only hope. We can only hope. Um, maybe it was entirely irrelevant. Okay, so it's October. Or it's getting to the bad times of year again. And I haven't done much. I maybe should get rid of even more of this path. Look how much more decor I've added, though. Even though things are kind of convoluted and weird. I've added more stuff. And we're looking at... Profit for September, that, that's great. Um, and that was with the park admissions going from 192 in August to 36 in September. That's pretty crazy. You know, they really dropped. I think we have to do a lot of advertising in the bad months. You know? I think we have to do m multiple advertising campaigns. Um, so as it gets colder, we're going to have to advertise for... Not the water ride. Top scan? There's already so many people that want to go on that. I said we advertise the pirate ship. But is this a bad idea because it's like, it's just not that fun? <sighs> Swinging ship cost $84. One month of flyers. I mean, I could go even bigger. Advertise at bus stops. But I'm not going to make that much money. In general. For the month. Let's just try. We're not going to know unless we try. We're not going to know unless we try. So we just, we need to advertise things. I could have just also done a park advertisement. What about free ride voucher? Free park entrance voucher. You know, get more people into the park. We'll do that in one of the even colder months. Okay. Let's try to make sure we have one advertising campaign per month. This is sort of like where instead of our research money, it'll go towards this. Instead of spending money on research. We can try it. Um, okay, so this is going on at bus stops, okay? It's more than the flyers. It should bring in a lot of people. But with the ride only costing 250 to go on it? I don't know if that's going to matter. Someone on the radio mentioned Maple Mountain. Nobody wants to go on Maple Mountain in October. What were they thinking? Okay, well, let me bring the prices back up. <laughs> okay, nobody wants to go to Maple Mountain in October. I think this is not bad. Okay, yeah, see? November? Um, October we had operating profit, $14, okay? Overall is negative 110, but guess how much the advertising cost? Huh? Huh? It cost, oh, well, you can't see it anymore, but wasn't it like 110? <laughs> So, it's fine. It's fine. After this advertisement is done, we pay back more of the loan. I think once this advertisement is done, um, like our next sort of like monthly cost will be that. And I say we speed up even more through this time. If I'm not building anything, then just speed up. Speed everything up. We are in the negatives, but it's going to pick right back up. It's going to pick right back up. Effectiveness 99%. Once again, okay, yeah, and look, there's our money. Okay, everyone calm down, there's our money. Um, picked right back up. How many, there's literally no one here. How can you say that? <laughs> How can you say that that was the effectiveness? There's no one here, well, eh. Um, maybe it helped, I suppose, maybe. Okay, so end of November, we see what our profits are. 
is it still November? It is still November. Why do we dip down to the negatives again? Positives. Bring it back up. Positives. That's too negative. That's like really negative. Bring it back up, please. Oh, great. There are vandals like, roaming around again. Can I manually go around and find the vandals and like tell security to take them away, I wonder? Or do I have to just let security naturally find them? I don't know. Um, we did not make profit in October or November. We didn't even make operating profit in November. Which is bad. Okay, I was going to pay off loan, but I think instead... Oh, I don't have the money for it. Uh-oh. Bring my money back up, please. Bring my money back up. Bring my money back up, please. I just need enough money in my pocket <laughs> in order to start another advertising campaign. <laughs> We're going to advertise a free park entrance voucher. $2,000. Oh my god. We're going to advertise a free ride voucher. You can go on the... Gravitron for free. Oh, it's only $50. Exactly. Okay. Perfect. Because two years ago we advertised for this thing. It didn't do so well. 61%. We can do better than that. Top scan, I feel like, doesn't need advertising. And then advertising for the low intensity ones, I feel like maybe people don't care about that. Maybe people don't want that that much. I think the guest happiness has gone up. I think. I might be crazy, but I think maybe it's gone up. And the immersion, I think it's maybe gone slightly up. Oh, oh, look, look. Happiness and immersion are both going up. <sighs> okay. Okay. Uh, yeah. Good. Great. Um, I should advertise for the paddle boats at some point. That's what I should have put it for. I mean, it's got a decent... It's got a decent amount. Um, okay... When are they going to start yelling at me? <laughs> at what time? How many How many fail, failed months do I have to have in a row for them to start yelling at me? Maybe because it... Oh. I was going to say maybe because it keeps popping up back into the positives for a moment. Um, it's okay. But we don't even get up into the positives this time. Come on. You can get to the positives. You can get up to the positives. Go, go, go. You could do it. I believe in you. It's January. It's not a time that anyone wants to be at a park, but still, it's fine. Um, this, lower this, lower this. Three dollars, okay? It's only three dollars to go in this way. Okay, yeah, yeah, it went to the positive. It went to the positive. Yes. Okay, just gotta pay off my loan. That's all we're looking to do. Pay off my loan. Oh, okay. Why does it cost so much more to operate it? Like, why does that fluctuate so much? I don't know. Gravitron voucher ended. Effectiveness 65%. Dang, they just don't like this ride. I mean, but those vouchers are so cheap. We should do more of them, right? Um, some of these queues are filled up. Why is there this many people on this ride? They like this in the cold weather? I guess they like it kind of... All times of year. Long queue time. Ooh. I think they'd have... I think they'd have less queue time. I mean, obviously, if I made the queue shorter. But if I blocked off a little more of the pond, and they didn't go everywhere... I'm um, complaining about trash. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's bigger things for them to be complaining about. <sighs> Give it a rest. There's certainly bigger things for them to complain about, okay? Oh, and there's our eminent bankruptcy notice. Okay. Well, we're gonna figure this out. Um, we're gonna figure this out. Park admissions. Ride admissions. Um, park admissions is so bad right now. We got it to go up in January. That was probably for my advertising, right? I don't actually know. <sighs> do I do I try and wait it out or do I get another loan? I'm just I 
I don't know if I can wait it out. Like, I don't know if in general we can, we can do better than this until I have a high intensity ride. I think it's just going to be up and down and up and down and up and down. Like, good in the summer, bad in the winter, good in the summer, bad in the winter. And, like, we're never going to, like, really kick off. I mean, I guess if I could scrounge up a few more decor items here and there every single summer when I'm actually making profit. But, yeah, it's not looking good. It's February. We have until March. But it's not looking too good good. I mean, park admissions are going up again. Ride admissions are down, though. People just don't like the rides that I have as much in the wintertime. I think I have to take out another loan, which is just going to extend everything even longer. You know, it's going to make my time here before I've, like, completed the goal even longer. But why don't we take out a loan and actually... Why don't we, why don't we just be smart about it this time? Interestingly, it seems like the loans that you can take out change. Because before, there was a second one for $5,000. There was also one for $7,000. They won't let me take out either of those anymore. Like, they're not here. They're not showing up. So I have to take out, like, this one for $12,000. And the monthly fee is pretty steep. So we might lose everything by doing this. You could only have two loans out at a time. We might lose everything by doing this, but I'm going to take this loan. I'm going to repay this loan entirely. Maybe this is a bad idea. Um, then I'm going to make a roller coaster. And it's going to go down here so that people have something to do while they're down here. Um, I don't maybe need to get rid of that tree. Okay. I'm going to make a roller coaster. I will make it myself, but everything's paused. And so if it turns out catastrophically bad... Then I just, um, okay, there's four stations. Um, then I will just delete it and I'll get all my money back, I believe. Okay, so now we need liftoff. The most intense liftoff you can get. Uh, wow. How many of these can I do? Oh my god. Okay, don't do that, don't do that. Just one. Build. Build. Um, build it up as high as you possibly can. Oh, oh, oh. This is so expensive. I seriously can build it this high? Um, I'm running out of room. <laughs> okay, okay. Too high for supports. Too high for supports. Okay. Um, so then we go straight. No, we go straight down. Look at that. Look at that, guys. <laughs> um, this is not lift track anymore, right? Okay, it's going down, build, down, build, and then turn, and then down, build. Oh no, it's outside of my park. Dang it. Okay, previous segment, delete. Okay, it got a little convoluted. Because we had to just... <laughs> this is psychotic. We were going straight up and then we turn and drop down. Turn and drop down. And then we're just going to go down, down, down. Uh, 
Just, just down. Just go down. Yeah. Uh, down some more. Okay, and then, no, we're not going underground. We're going to level out a little bit here. We're going to fully level out. And we're going to turn... Um, I don't want to build six segments. We're going to do a big turn. Okay, big turn. And then we're going to turn the other direction and go up. And surely they have enough momentum for that, right? Um, and then we're turning again, but we're going down. No, we're turning still, but we're going down. Oh, okay, wait, we have to level out first. Uh, and then you get to go down. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Perfect. This looks like a death trap. Okay, and then... Um... Level out a little more. Go a little less. You're going straight. Uh... This is... This is... Not working, is it? We need like an S curve to go back. Okay, we went up too high. We went up too high. I only go up by two, okay? And then we drop down. Yes, extremely steep drop. And then twist this way. And give it a little angle right at the end there. Yeah. It's really scare the people. Um, I have made a full coaster. Now, is this coaster completely unhinged? Yes. 100%. <laughs> um, does that matter? Hopefully not. Duration is 41 seconds. Okay, I have no clue if it's even going to work yet. I have to check. The majority of the ride is the part where it brings you up to the top. Um, it looks like the pulling part ends like right here, so they're not going to be able to pull all the way up. But I, I thought I had it go up all the way. We'll just have to see. Please work, please work, please work. I spent so much time on this. Please work, please work, please work, please work, please work. It doesn't work. Only straight up ones can be... Uh... I guess maybe only straight up ones can be the pulling kind. Oh, so what do I do about this part? I have to get rid of this piece. And then the next piece I have to get rid of as well. And then this next piece I have to get rid of. And this piece. So we're at height 19. We need to make sure that side is at height 19. Is this height 19? That's height 21. Okay, now it's height 19 and height 19. So this piece should go immediately... Uh, immediately down, I'm fine with. But how would we curve around? We'll curve around. I'll do it. Okay. Um, it goes immediately down... And then it curves around, but not, um, not at the highest level of whatchamacallit. And we're going to give it a little twirl as well. It goes out of the park at that point. Like, I just can't actually physically put it in over here. <sighs> it seems like it would be the most exciting for it to go up and immediately down. But I don't think I can afford that. So instead, we have to go up. Um, delete that piece. Okay, so we go up. Yes. And then immediately... Flat. And turn. Yeah, I think we have to do that. This is so annoying. I can't get everything to meet up. <sighs> okay, go to the next one. Um... 
I don't necessarily want to get rid of this one if I can just... I can't just change it. Okay, let's get rid of it. I have to somehow just get this to meet up. And then we'll be fine. I think I did it. Oh no, it's eight and a quarter and it's nine. It's eight and a quarter and it's nine, are you kidding me? But that's fine, it's fine. Um, we're just gonna not have this one go up as high. Yeah, this just won't go up as high. I say as I can only seem to make it go up that high. No, okay. We do that. And then get rid of this one. And then, I mean, that looks perfect. Is that perfect? Oh my god. I think it's perfect. Okay, but do any of these need to be... I don't think any of them can be pulling ones. But I think I need extra pull. Can this part be a pulling piece? I'm just gonna go along the whole track. Um, no, dang it, I rotated too far. Okay, I'm just gonna go along the whole track with this little button and see when the thing lights up to let it be pulley pieces. Oh, it, it won't do it ever. That's annoying. So I don't actually know when I can make it like that. Is that what you're telling me? I feel like I could make one right Blah, 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 blah. Let's just see. Let's just watch the blue. See if it... <laughs> if it will work now. Although it doesn't really look like it's that much different on the top than it was before. I don't know. The perspective is very weird sometimes. This will be fine, right? It's going up to the top. It's going up. It's going... You've got to be kidding me! It gets to here, and then it falls. I just want to make a stupid coaster, because the thing only goes to here. But then why? Why Why aren't these pieces like that? What happened? Because I wanted them to be. Like, I specifically... But then it was like, oh, you can't make the turning ones or whatever. But, like, I thought I made this flat. I thought, look, look, it's supposedly flat. I know it doesn't look flat, but I was like, oh, the perspective is just weird, right? It just must be weird. I have to scrap the whole thing and make a new one. Because this just doesn't... I, I can't. It's not making sense. It won't work. At 19 and a half, it was lifting it up the whole time. <sighs> okay. Then, we're going to... Drop immediately. No lift. It's a free drop. Drop immediately. Okay. And then we start turning. And we twist. And we just keep dropping. Go again. And now twist the other direction. And go like this the other direction. Good. And now go back. Um this way good you're gonna they're gonna die on this <sighs> good and then slow it down slow it down we're going straight uh no um actually just go like this level it out level it out okay just go like this Okay, we're at level six, and we're going straight for like two seconds, okay? Good. Oh, but it's actually still not straight. Level it out all the way. Build another one piece. Okay, and then we're gonna be lifting again. We're gonna be going up, we're gonna put the lift on, and we're going up, 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 up. Okay, I know, I would rather there not have to be a second lift portion and just the momentum takes you, but we are apparently not dealing with that. And yes, this coaster is turning out to be basically the same uh, shape as my other one was. Uh, uh, you know, a loop. It just does like one direction. It doesn't like go in and over around itself and stuff like that. But I'm just trying to do something on my own and not have it be a pre-made thing. Um, and so then once we're up here... 
once we're up once we're up uh, we have to do okay you immediately go down it's so confusing um, okay you immediately go down and down and then you curve no let's curve the other way okay let's give it a little twist I think they're twisting backwards at that point let's give them an 85 degree twist what does that do how crazy does that look I can't even tell <laughs> but we want it to go this way no we want it to go this way uh what do we want to do here 85 degree twist is kind of wild yeah let's just go like that whatever that is do it and then we're sneaking back around this way we're leveling out we're bringing them back to normal and then we're flattening it out we're on the ground now we're flattening it out we're flattening it out okay um slight turn because we got to get past all those things and yeah this is fine. We're just going right back home now. This will work. Okay, yes. Yeah, see, look. It goes over the thing, and then it goes down here, and then it goes this way, and it goes down, and there's a spot back there. It's crazy. And then it comes around here, and then it's done. Okay. Now, they said... Wait, what did that say? <laughs> How did I... S where was it showing me the information? It was just showing me the information somewhere. I just said exit I already put down. Um, the intensity, the excitement is low, but the intensity is ultra extreme, which is in the red. Why is the excitement low if it's, okay. Some guests like intense elements such as high g-forces, tall drops, and inversions. Some don't. Their preference can change slightly as they spend time in the park. It's ultra extreme, okay? This is, everyone's been complaining, saying that they want more extreme rides. We're going to give them an extreme ride. They might die. We're going to find out what happens if you accidentally have a lawsuit, I guess. We're going to find out what happens if you have a lawsuit. Because this is my... This is my ride. Um, can I go on the ride cam? Um, ride cam. Oh, I see what you're saying. You want me to place a ride cam somewhere. Oh, I thought it meant I could see it. What about follow? No. Oh, man. I wanted to experience it. Okay. Well, we're going to see how this works. It was This was about a $6,000 coaster. It doesn't have any um, decorations as of yet. But my god, I just spent like 50, 100,000 years on this. Um, I need my cue to be the right color. I don't even have enough room for the queue here. Um, how are we going to do this? I feel like the best I can do for now is kind of like go like from here to here. Uh, yeah, like get rid of these pieces. Let them also be queue pieces. That's not a very long queue, but people might hate this ride, so I guess that's that's that. And then this path goes along this way, then this path exits out here. I just want to see. I've spent so much time on this, I just want to see, okay? What's going to happen? Press play. Okay, no more eminent bankruptcy. So yeah, if you guys didn't couldn't tell, it goes all the way up and then it immediately drops and is like rotating you. Um, basically you're going to feel like you're going on a fighter jet. Um, there's a lot of G-forces here at play, okay? And then it levels out for a hot second and pu pulls you up another hill and only to drop you possibly even steeper than the last time with more twirls, but uh, much quicker. And then bam, you're on the ground. And so it feels kind of like you just fell out of like something onto the ground and died. Is it okay that there's all these trees under here? I feel like it maybe isn't okay. And then there's like a nice little fun curve at the end. And there are some breaks. I don't know if I if I braked enough at the end, but we did put some brakes on. Uh, I guess we'll find out. <laughs> if I get rid of these trees, 
Okay, it doesn't add supports in. So I guess this just part just is never going to look like it has supports. There's a couple of parts that just don't look like they have supports because I didn't get rid of the trees first. Um, I guess that's just going to be the way it is. <laughs> Surplus of ice, decreasing prices by 31%. That's cool and all. Okay, I just want to see the first customer reviews for the wooden coaster. We should give it a name at some point. But um, it is open. I just have to see if anybody wants to go on it. Can I make these? I, I should make the color of the things different. The cars, yeah. Okay, knock knock, hello! We've got a big new coaster for everybody. Don't you want to go on the coaster? Everybody said that they wanted a more intense ride. Well, now's your intensity. Now is your intensity. The immersion went down because we have that terribly decorated coaster. Let's look at the G-forces. Ooh. <laughs> I don't remember what it said. It told me something about the G-forces in the... um. What's it called? Oh, the immersion and the happiness are actively going down. In the tutorial, it told me something about how, like, guests, or not guests, people in general, like, uh, maybe negative ones are bad and positive ones are good. No, these seems like these would be bad. It, said, it says positive, but I think this is bad. Like, you bam, just stop like that. It's not very fun. So there are some some pretty hefty g-forces there and then there's some pretty hefty ones there but these are the ones they like that one's like wow like that it's too bad there isn't one here but at least there's one there and there's a little bit of something there um but then there's also ladder lateral and longitudinal that are other things that are good and bad forces to the right and left are good and bad in some way or other but i i don't remember all of it Ugh, but there's something that they hate about this ride, apparently, because no one will even try it. Airtime? Oh, God. Oh, God. It looks like it breaks enough by the end. Sure, it's fine. It's going super fast at this point. It's flying around that curve. They're going to lose their minds. Ooh, decoration rating, not the best. They're going to lose their minds while they're getting increasingly upset. Why won't anyone try it? I think I'm just going to have to delete it next time and make a pre-made one. Everybody hates this ride. It's probably too deadly to try. Maybe it just needs a little bit of advertising, like a sign. It just needs a sign that says, Coasters this way! These signs are not for that. These signs are for, um, this. We put a sign right here, and we put no entry for guests. Staff only. How cute. Okay, and then we don't have to have the gate there. Maybe that helps them. I don't know. I've got no clue at all. Uh, so the sign was not what they wanted. There's still zero guests. All the vandals will have left the park. That's fun and cool, I guess. If you want to lie to yourself, but uh, let's get them a $26 TV. Surely people will like this ride if there's a TV here, right? I think I just spent $6,000 on something that no one will use. Why won't they even say anything about it? Like, oh, looks too intense for me or something, you know? Like, I get that it says ultra extreme and therefore some guests will like it and some don't. But everyone said there aren't enough intense rides. There aren't enough intense rides. Everyone was saying that. <sighs> I guess it's just too intense. I'm just too good. <sighs> I guess I'm just too good at making scary things. I mean, I, I figured, hey. Every time I've ever had a coaster, they're like medium intensity, low intensity. So I said, you know what? No, we're going to go and we're making the most intense coaster absolutely possible. And I did that. And now they're upset with me. Whatever. I'll have to fix it next episode because it's been almost two hours. So 
Wow, look how cool it is though, guys. It's so cool. If only there was not as bad of G-forces, I guess. But I was working with very limited space, okay? So, yeah. Um, I mean, I would be horrified. <laughs> this? I would be horrified. But, uh, whatever. Okay. I mean, like, maybe they just don't know about it, you know? Maybe we do an advertising campaign. We're gonna advertise on the... We're gonna advertise on television. For the wooden coaster. Starting now. Okay? Everyone's gonna know about this coaster. And so some people are gonna try it. And then we're gonna see what happens. Um... Yeah, let's see if this does anything. It'll be like, advertising worked... 0%. I feel like they should tell you if your ride is a ride that literally no one is going to go on. I feel like they should tell you. I'm pretty sure I have everything set up, right? Like, the queue looks fine, I think. Wooden Coaster advertisement ended effectiveness 87%. You are lying to me, okay? It can't be 87% because guess what? There's still never been anyone on it. Unless the people are filing in right now, I think we just... There's never been anyone on it. We just demolish it and, uh... We try a new one next time. Everyone's literally just walking straight past it. No one has any interest in trying it. It's insane. Oh my god. Okay, well, I... <gasps> oh, oh. There's someone here. Guys, there's someone. There's someone, there's someone, there's someone. Zoom in. Oh, It's just the janitor. You've gotta be kidding me. I think this park is just dead. No, I'm gonna have to just, you know, bring, give this money back and either get a pre-built coaster that's medium intensity or um, just keep the loan money, like you know, most of the loan money, I think I have like $8,000 or something. Just keep that and um, research thrill rides and try and get a more intense thrill ride, not coaster. Because absolutely no one is interested in this coaster. So whatever. I wasted an hour of my life. I don't care. <laughs> I at least maybe learned some things. Whatever. Okay, that's it for today, guys. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye now.